<laughs> we finally return. Hey, yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back. Today, we're going to be saying, we're going to be saying this. Zendaya gets jealous over the attention that Tom Holland gets from females. It's been a long time. So smash like, subscribe, and let's get into it. Off-screen relationship. That Tom Dea was the very... If you could pick any love interest from the Marvel Universe for Spider-Man, who would it be? I think Scarlet Witch is pretty hot. We all relish an on-screen romance, especially when it leads to an epic off-screen relationship. That Tom Dea was the very first name that flashed your mind. Tom Holland, our very own Spider-Man, who's made audiences laugh, cry, and everything. In well, <laughs> debatable. He's played many other roles. <clears throat> Jacob shows some examples. Exhibit A, Exhibit B, and Exhibit C. <clears throat> yes, thank you, thank you, Jacob, for showing us those beautiful images. So, yep, that, that's your first thing. I'm going to put the muzzle on everything you say in this video, if it's guys or if it's true. Tween has been getting a lot of attention. Do you think the love he's receiving from everywhere, even from many female celebrities, is making his girlfriend jealous? Stay with us till the end of this video to find- See, this is how I know it's fake, cause Zendaya is not the jealousest type of gal. I, I don't know. I don't know her personally. I don't even know her physically. God, that sounded so fucking wrong. Jesus. Jesus. My- my commentary has gotten worse over the years. Golly. I used to be pro at this. I used to be an absolute god at this. That's not a god complex. I doubt. Trust me when I say that you won't be disappointed, as you're in for a real treat. Give it to me. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. If you're seeing our channel for the first time, then make sure to like, share, and subscribe. You always Don't forget have to click to the bell that. icon so you get notified every you just, time we post a you new just video. The video. And without further ado, let's get into it. Goodness, that's the love and attention Holland receives from celebrities, as well as his millions of fans, isn't yeah. something new. While from <clears throat> Um, AKA fangirls. <clears throat> Let's move on. Including Spider-Man Homecoming, Holland took part in a video segment for the British GQ YouTube channel. For the video, Holland drew questions from a hat and gave impromptu oh, answers. Okay. Don't you want to know about the yeah, question like and these. Holland's adorable answer to it? Because when asked to pick a love interest from the Marvel Universe, Holland went on to say, I think Scarlet Witch is pretty hot, you know? I think Elizabeth Olsen is super hot," he said. Oh, no, this is this is why you have to learn to hate your old self because you say messed up crap like this. Jesus, Jesus! Oh Lord, I am at your feet. Oh my goodness. And nice as well. She was nice to me at the premiere. So yeah, probably Scarlet Witch. Any love from the Marvel Universe or Spider-Man, who would it be? Oh lord almighty. I think this is also super And as we all know, Tom Holland is the king of manifestation. And he's Man proven himself several times. During an interview, Olsen opened up about her admiration for Tom Holland's performance. What? When, 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 when was this interview? I, I I want to watch. When was this interview? Because I, 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 I will search the dark web for this interview. For this quote. For this wired autocomplete interview. I will search high and low. Corner in every corner. File after file, I'll go onto the dark web and possibly buy human organs. Because cause if I can find this, then I can probably put it here, but yeah. In the MCU movies. She also added that she finds him extremely funny and would love to share the screen with him someday. Damn, can't help but think of Zendaya's... <clears throat> 
<clears throat> Avengers in <clears throat> Captain America Civil War Avengers Infinity War and a little bit of Avengers Endgame <clears throat> actions to this seriously who wouldn't be jealous Still, it is Tom Holland we're talking about here, the guy who never fails to prove himself as the best boyfriend out there. Truth be told, he is Zendaya's biggest cheerleader. Be it the times they spend together or the many cute interviews, he never misses a chance to show his love and admiration for his lady. Don't you remember the BuzzFeed BFF quiz, where Timothy was asked to name Zendaya's celebrity crush? Easy. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, no. Oh, this is where... This is stuff, well, this is where stuff started to go fan. Stuff started to hit the fan. This is where the duck met the duckling. Oh my goodness. Tom Holland, he replied, and Zendaya's reaction to the whole thing was extremely cute. It's been pointed out that when asked about his celebrity crush back in 2017, Tom Holland said, um, Zendaya. I mean, could they be any cuter? <clears throat> Zendaya recently You missed the key part <clears throat> He said jokingly mm -hmm. he, he, he psyched it right afterwards So but You can't really say that that's a piece of evidence But you do you <laughs> I have no problem with these two So and I have no problem with Celebrity Loop But we meet again chatted about Tom to InStyle, where she went on to say, There are many things that I appreciate about him. In an actor's way, I appreciate that he loves- Yep, she- Yep. <laughs> Thing is, is that by this point, photos were already out, so... <laughs> but if they weren't, then she's basically blue-balling us here, but, you know, we, we endorse that being Spider-Man. It's a lot of pressure. You take on the role of a superhero wherever you go. To the little kid that walks by, you are Spider-Man. I think he handled that so well. He's a fun time, very charismatic, can make anybody feel comfortable and have a good laugh and a good chat. A good chat? I sound so British. A lot of pressure, you know, because you, you take on the role of a superhero wherever you go now. You know, you know, to, to the little kid who walks by, you mm -hmm. know, you are spider -Man. Tam, that is a That is a euphoria interview. It's really sad that I know that. <laughs> uh. was seriously too much for Tamdea. Zendaya knows the power her words have on the many who root for the dynamic couple they are. Remember the time a rumor circulated that Holland was worried Zendaya would be swept off her feet by her other male co-stars, and that it was causing problems in the relationship? <laughs> when was that ever a problem? What are we talking about here? Because I'm, I'm lost. Was it when she was dating that guy, Jacob Elordi? Or was it in previous relationships, huh? Um, I don't know. I don't know. Thankfully, that was not the truth. Still, Thank we God. can't help but think about it. Tom Holland truly has reason to be jealous because it's none but Jacob Elordi himself in the picture. Fans have speculated that Zendaya and Jacob have dated in the past. The tabloid source explains, He has major issues over her connection with Jacob, even though she swears it's platonic and Tom has nothing to worry about. But he was also pretty paranoid when she got close to Timothy. Adding, Zendaya likes to get her flirt on, but Tom is the one she wants. The outlet- Wait, what? I, I'm the, someone point me to that. I, I, I want to see it because if this is true then oh my god it's going to be a it's going to be a field day for the internet and speculates that holland and zendaya have been secretly dating for years despite their recent pda confirming it Z wait a minute what? so are you telling me that zendaya 
Wait a minute. If this is actually true, if I might be considering this a bit wrong here. But was Jacob Awardy just a setup? And oh no. Then and Zendaya was seeing Tom under the table. <sighs> I've never thought of it that way. What if Jacob Elordi was just a cover? And they're not actually, that Jacob Elordi and Zendaya are not actually dating. They, it was a cover up. Oh my god, how have we been so foolish? Oh, yeah. uh, if that's the truth, then I probably just cracked the safe. Zendaya has been linked to several other romantic partners in recent years, though she's denied all of them. Holland was romantically linked to actress Nadia Parks just last year before they allegedly broke up. Moreover, both Holland and Zendaya are professional actors who can tell the difference between reality and fiction. Even if they are in a fully committed and exclusive relationship, there is no evidence that Holland is concerned about Zendaya becoming too close to her co-stars. Yeah, because Tom is not that type of guy. You don't get jealous when you're better at him at something, but you know. You know, I'm like, I don't know. I don't know what Tom, Thomas, Thomas, Jesus Christ, Tom gets jealous of these days. Because I haven't seen much of him lately, so. He's been ghosty a bit. When they say someone, when they say someone's a white ghost, I don't think they mean literally. For a couple who seem to have sworn to secrecy when it comes to their relationship, Tom Holland and Zendaya have come a long way. Tom Holland, um, secrecy, <clears throat> secrecy. <clears throat> Jacob, exhibit A. Thank you. Zendaya have been rumored to be dating for a long time, probably since they co-starred in Spider-Man Homecoming in 2017. PDA pictures of the duo from Tom Holland's car were spotted in July in 2021, even though they have been in denial for the longest time by claiming they're just good friends. These yeah. photographs mark the beginning of Tom Dea's public relationship. Initially, the couple wanted to keep their relationship just between the two of them. Tom Holland made this comment during an interview with British GQ that said, It means that if you're dating someone, you have to be conscious of their feelings. Because if something does happen between the two of you, it's not just happening between the two of you. It's happening in front of the entire world. And it can be very complicated. It's one of the things I worry about most, of all the things in my career. His words clearly show that he wants their relationship to last long and didn't want anything like the media to get in their way. Well, Tom, it didn't work, did it? See, something you don't understand, these guys might be grown-ups, but they still don't understand what the media truly is about. The media is not going to just say, like, oh, this person's famous, maybe we should stop. The media is relentless. They're not going to stop until they get a confession out of you. They're not going to stop until they get a sincere confession out of you. That's not how media works. They Like paparazzi, they're not going to stop anything until they eventually get an answer out of you. It's like, it's like traumatic torture. You beat someone half to death until they eventually give you an answer. Why have I just considered that tort? Oh my goodness. But yeah, these two don't understand the media truly. The media is relentless, so I don't understand how they think that this relationship would, wouldn't go out to the public. You guys might be good actors, but you guys are not great at playing it off. See, so, I don't know what Tom and Z's game plan was. They say they want to keep it private. Yeah. Zendaya reciprocated to this, as she went on to quote, The equal sentiment we both share is that just when you love and care about somebody, some moment or things you wish were your own. And continued to explain, I think loving someone is a sacred thing and a special thing, 
and something that you want to deal with and go through and experience and enjoy amongst the two people that love each other. The couple became Instagram official in September 2021 on Zendaya's birthday when Tom posted a sweet Instagram post for his girlfriend. My MJ have the happiest of birthdays, he wrote, referring to Zendaya's role as his on-screen love interest in Spider-Man. Give me a call when you're up, he added, to which Zendaya responded, calling now. Zendaya did the same thing for Tom's birthday on June 1st, 2022, where she captioned the post, happiest of birthdays to the one who makes me the happiest. Because of their adorable chemistry, even the smallest interactions between the couple are so pure. Their on-screen and off-screen interactions never cease to amaze us. Oh yeah, trust me, whenever something happens between these two, oh you bet you they're going, that the media, the paparazzi, the fans, the fangirls, fanboys, they're all going to have a field day. They're all going to have a field day. It's mad, but yeah. I respect these two, even though I do say a bit of mad things towards them, but I do respect these two. I didn't believe the rumors in the beginning, but yeah. But it really makes me think, did they do this for stage clout? Because, like, Tom and Z have never really came off as the type of people who want to get clout. They want to get clout so they can treat people differently. I've never really seen them as that, but, you know, there could be a secret that we probably don't know. But they're not perfect people. Even though people might say they are. You could ask Tom and them and Z herself that themselves that no one is perfect, no one is the magic child as well, unless you count Jesus as the magic child, which then you might have a point. But no one on earth, like no one that is mortal, no one that is mortal and is on earth is the perfect person. There's always going to be an, a downside to that person. You either love them or you hate them. Or you either despise them or you, or you absolutely, or you want them abominated from this world. But yeah. The stylish Euphoria star was seen putting her hand on Tom's back as they walked together to dinner during a New York visit. Before their dinner, Tom was the consummate gentleman, carrying her dark green coat in his arms. The Spider-Man stars held hands after dinner, with Zendaya wearing the coat. Not to mention the time Z and Tom wore identical jerseys to a Rangers game. Tom and Z then went on to personalize their jerseys with a little something extra that drew a lot of attention. Zendaya's jersey said Holland, while his said Zendaya. Can we talk about this for a second? How in the crap did they get this onto their jerseys. Either the Rangers sent them their own customized jerseys or Tom and Z blacklisted their own jerseys for the Rangers. Their jerseys also had the number 96 on them as a nod to their birth year. If you assume that was it, the couple spiced things up by swapping their jerseys, with Z wearing Tom's on her way out and Tom wearing hers. Name a more iconic couple than these two. See, so like, we get these pictures, but we never hear what they're saying. Ah, it's so upsetting. Oh, man. If only we could get one of their Euphoria co-stars on our back. Okay. That sounded a bit mud. Okay. No one take that out of your con. No one take that out of the context, please. Okay? She can't. Do you want to know how the couple proved to be couple goals during their NYC shopping spree? The couple was spotted shopping at NYC's Prada Boutique in the Soho district. The couple appeared to be in a good mood as they joked around in the store. How adorable is that? Speaking of the bond the duo share, rumor has it that Tom Holland and Zendaya are planning to take their relationship to the next level. Tom Holland revealed his desire to be a father in an interview with People. He quoted, I Oh no. I forgot about this. I have no problem with Tom, but I'm just going to be honest. Tom 
would seriously make his child spoiled. Goodness gracious. Oh my goodness. Because if he does that, then that child belongs to the streets. And so does Tom. Yeah. Kick him out, but I don't think Tom's a wife beater. I don't think he's a wife beater, is he? No. Probably isn't love kids. I can't wait to be a dad. I can wait, and I will, but I can't wait. The British actor He's told just the site, if I'm at twice. a wedding or a party, I'm always at the kids' table hanging out. Back. My dad's been such a great role model for me. I think I've got that from him, so I think I'd be a primary school teacher or something like that. He also went on to quote, Well, if your acting career didn't blow up, but maybe he could become a primary school teacher if his acting career died. Or he just isn't popping anymore. I've spent the last six years being so focused on my career. I want to take a break and focus on starting a family and figuring out what I want to do outside of this world. But a source very close to the couple revealed some exclusive updates to Hollywood life. That said, while Zendaya isn't quite ready to have children, she isn't giving up on the notion of getting married. And yes, she is madly in love with Tom. The source went on to add, Just like any other serious couple, they have talked about what their future holds, including getting married and having kids together. They both want the same things when it comes to a family. But he knows that she's not ready for that at the moment. And that Goodness. Oh, that's a topic there. But I'm not going to talk about it here. I'm going to talk about that in a newer, in a, a more updated video. But yeah, of my thoughts on this. But this is like from days, from months ago. But yeah. She's extremely focused on her career. Does, are, 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 are you sure about that? Are, 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 you, are you sure? Uh, lad. I think she just finished the Challenger game. Not the cha- Oh my god. I forgot what it's called. Oh, this is- This is ticking me off. The Challenger? Challenger? I forgot what it's called. I forgot what it's called. She just finished that tennis movie. And literally, a couple months after that, she starts doing fucking role model things. Goodness gracious. That mean we could expect a star studded wedding any day soon? Let's keep our. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> If, if I know anything about Tom and Z, they ain't going to have a public wedding. I'm not going to lie. It's only going to be their family members and their friends. And probably Tom's brothers and probably Zendaya's brothers and sisters. I, I, if we know Tom and Z, they're not that stupid. Well, some of their pictures say otherwise, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopes high and stay optimistic about what's to come. With that being said, we've come to the end of the video. Do let us know about your personal favorites from the video in the comment section below. Oops. Well, yeah, that's going to do it for this one. See you guys next time. Peace. All right, before this video ends, I just want to let you know that Sanity, my third song on my album, is out on YouTube. Go. Go. Go view it, get them clicks. Let's try it. Let's go. Go listen to the song. It's a banger. It's not the best song, but it's a good one. So, yeah. That's the end of the video. Bye.